your start list for the balance exercise up first. And Andrea, what should we be looking out for here? So, similar to the dynamic that we saw before, the judges are looking at execution, artistic and overall difficulty. But with groups, they're able to do uh, pyramids as well, so they have to do a minimum of two separate pyramids, and those have to be from different categories in the table of difficulty, and then a minimum of three static elements as well. Israel will be up first, the first of six groups in this women's competition. What's so funny? in the arena here great start from uh, israel slightly different lineup to the team from the world championships but andrea always difficult going first and they've done exceptionally well they really have the first element it was very strong indeed an overall impression of the routine is that they had a pretty good level of difficulty particularly on that last pyramid the last hold Notice that they do the unsupported handstands, the one right at the very top. That's important as well. If they miss out some of the elements, if they miss out the handstand, there are deductions or penalties of a point. But they all complement each other so well. It's very much about a partnership and collaboration when it comes to these group events. That was really steady, beautiful alignment on the handstand. And very nicely held there. They all have to be held for a minimum of three seconds to count. They we're very quickly into the mounts as well, right to the top to the straddle lever and beautifully into the handstand. Lovely extension of the legs and feet. And this was a very difficult one. Just a few tiny little wobbles, 
So a few little adjustments and you can see from the expression on people's faces that they really appreciated the difficulty of that move. The crowd looking on in awe at the skill of these gymnasts, the strength of these gymnasts. And now Israel can relax for a little on the red sofa. This, I think, could be a really healthy score. 28, 4, 5, 0, difficulty 2.6. Number two. Uh, so that uh, could hold them towards the top throughout this balance qualification. Next up is the team from the Netherlands.